All right, welcome to episode four of This is the Police. It's day seven, July 21st. Racist gangs around Wildman City. Mayor Rogers will bring order to the police station. And Francis Kendrick is still possibly under investigation. If you remember in the last episode, I fucked up pretty hard. I accidentally arrested someone who had ties to the head of the Red Mask gang, and I should not have done so. So we'll see what happens. I also did not fire any of my black officers, because that's fucked up. The people of Freeburg have built up a tolerance for the petty horrors of modern life. You'll never see crowds gathering around a beaten passerby. Folks rarely even slow to gawk at a car accident. And street theft doesn't turn heads anymore. Been a long time since people got worked up about stuff like that. So when I ran into a troubled crowd on the way to work, I knew there was something serious going on. <laughs> Something bad enough to knock these people out of their daily rhythm. And we're talking about people who would step over a corpse if it was blocking the door to the coffee shop. But apparently all it takes is a bunch of leaflets, or spreading broken glass across Main Street, or releasing a couple of hundred rats in the ice arena. The mysterious figure taking responsibility for these strange acts goes by the alias Robespierre. Nobody knows who he is, what he wants, or what all this adds up to, from the buckets of lard spread on the sidewalk to the front door of City Hall covered with ostrich <laughs> feathers. But this strange cross between childhood pranks and cheap theatrics has got the people all worked up. Everyone understands when some Freeburg crook satisfies the basic human need to rob and kill. But when someone steals a lion from the local zoo and locks him in a cell below the courthouse, the people start asking questions. Myself, I kind of like this robes Pierre. It's not just the pranks he's pulling or his green bull's head emblem. I just like his funny nickname. Robes Pierre? Really? Who does that make me? The Marquis de Lantanac? <laughs> I don't think so. In the old books about revolutions, I fancy Robes myself Pierre. the old gunner. It's such a, war with a bag like a shitty comic powder. name, and I love Maybe it. the innkeeper who tops up the beer kegs with mop water. Hmm. It's something to think about. Okay, so we have met Robespierre now. For the first time in this game. Martin Stett is my new deputy. Good to know. Let's go ahead and start the day. New records can be obtained as a gift or a thank you, but why wait when you can refill your collection now? Let's go to the catalog. The works of this catalog, you always find a rich assortment of the possible lowest price pre order and save. What do we got here? What do we got? Oh, I can hit up some new stuff. I'm gonna do snag it. And then maybe some clarinet sugar right now. Yeah? Like it. But first. Which one's this? Bud Meets Bob did that last time. Let's do our new one. Clarinet sugar. By Bob Bernard. Ooh. Okay. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm -hmm. Mavi can offer you some interesting services. You're a member of their family now, so it will hardly cost you a thing. Let's hit it. Ah, oh, the sands, yes. Mafia will falsify a special crime and progress report, and all the officers I've ever seen will be killed. Mafia will falsify a special investigation. Oh, interesting. I don't need any of those. I need to kill. Your new sister, no Kendrick, so he's, but he's not as useless as he might seem. You have some of your duties when you're pressed for time, but watch is on you, along with any other expenses. Let's see what's up. Hmm. Okay. Not gonna do any of that yet. Let's see what we got here. Is Birch fucked up yet? Ah, two out of three. He's got one more failure coming before I can fire him. Alright, athletic shoe shop. Shoe store clerk reports are too dangerous to find the most expensive shoes. Try them on without paying ran out of the shop. So I'm gonna send father and son. Go handle it. That's easy. 
This should be easy. Should be easy. Doesn't mean it's gonna be. So the money to give or take, I get paid, I also get some mafia stuff. Hmm. Okay. The game keeps getting deeper and deeper. It's, uh, Fender escaped. Officers unharmed. My battery is low. We got an attempted murder. Uh, returns from work earlier than usual. Found his wife in bed with her lover. Maid called the police when she saw the husband taking a hunting rifle from the cabinet wall. We're gonna send Stovall. We're gonna send Durock. And we're gonna send Asano to go handle it. And then I go in here. And I'm going to fire Birch Jr. Can I fire Pops with him? Hmm? I can. So we got two officers. I'm gonna. It's a shift A, right? So we're gonna hire Megadopolis, and we're gonna hire uh, Mr. Danny Sexbang here. So the Birch Boys, gone. Not doing their job well at all. Did I set Birch and Birch Jr. up for failure? A little bit. Back to the future. Oh, film distributors, that's it. So, yeah, absolutely. I will send Vandal. That is an easy job to do there. <laughs> the Birch Boys, on their last day on the job, because they suck at being police officers. An attempted murder report. Thunder caught. Officers unharmed. Civilians unharmed. Good job, team. And they're all on their way back. No open investigation. Still can't believe, I'm still mad that I fucked up that investigation. Young father, deprived of his parental rights, tried to pick up his daughter from school, wasn't allowed to attack teacher, knocked her around, started kicking her. So we're gonna send Mitchell, we're gonna send Yancey, and we're gonna send Grant. See if we can get some, see if we can get Grant some, some professionalism points here. I'm trying to make things better. I have a very sensitive issue, which our mutual friend Charles Dilly said you can help me with. You may or know I own a large music store, so my ex-wife got half my record collection. So every records. Max is very afraid of the police, and so she's just acting like a law-abiding citizen. So you guys went over there in uniform and told her that those records are evidence of important investigation. She just smiled and gives them whatever they ask for, and not even check into the warrant. Okay, so I'm going to send Stovall and Robbins and Birch Jr. See what happens. Mafia assignment. Jack, we have something going down at engineering plant at 2209. We don't want any policemen crashing the party. I think 4,000 should be enough for a request. So at 2209, they're going to have something in the engineering plant, and I'm going to ignore the call for four grand. Let's get as dirty as fuck. Perhaps there's some kind of exhibit scroll pictures of penises. Perfect. Let's go for it, guys. 2209. Ulrich Bieber, we helped him. Gave us a General Crespo album. Trooper Chinier prefers Glam, but he was really sad. Okay, and then ooh, three grand. Hell yeah. Assault. Offender caught. Officers unharmed. Civilians unharmed. Good job, team. Grant, back up over a hundred. Just like waiting for 2209. See what happens. Mm hmm. <laughs> All lights are on. Police arrive. Music. Like a job a few weeks. We're gonna be fired over this. Please calm him down. Points about the stall that the artist locked himself in. We're gonna break down the door. Hold a knife. Understands him. Threatens to stab himself. Offender caught. Officers unharmed. Good job, team. Birch, you're still fired. Sorry. <laughs> Trying to get to 2209 here. Hmm. Should ignore the call. Engineering plant, huh? Is this it for the day? Can I close it down when these guys get back? Am I gonna get the call? Van Dahl's gone. Birch Jr.'s gone. What happens if I take the call? I'm gonna close it. What was the call? Uh, uh, nope, just gonna close it. Gonna ignore it. Sorry about it. Don't worry, things will be fine.
Ooh, four grand. Just like that. Theft. Fender escaped. Close. Well, sorry. Psychological test. Jack, you've seen the newspaper stories about Tomas Blaine, their tire cop went schizophrenic and shows tragedy to himself. We decided to conduct psychological testing for all the cops over 50 years of age. That includes tomorrow. Dr. Waterbury will be waiting for you in her office, double eight. Ooh, psychological testing. How interesting. What else is going to happen? Anything else going to happen? Can I end for the day? End for the day. What a good day. I made some money. I'm just going to end the day here. I like it. I like it. I'm not going to... Everyone gets a day off tomorrow. Day 8, July 22nd. See Treasury doles on $90,000 for Mayor's birthday. Six new restaurants will appear in the city by year's end. And mysterious Robespierre announces political ambitions. Interesting. Robespierre trying to get in the politic game. Why not? Why not? Dr. Waterbury, Mr. Boyd, this simple test will show you a card with an abstract image. Just look at them. Tell me what you see. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I don't see any of that. Guess? Yeah. Wow, there's some vulgar shit in here. This is all... This seems like some family shit going on here. Yeah, I don't even. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you're. This all just went the same way. I don't. I don't understand any of this. It's fine. Hopefully, I don't get fired for that. Day nine! Just like that? What? Shea Broom, re-elected as Freeburg General Attorney. Major businessmen ready to invest in the future of the city. No black employees at City Hall. Mayor says, accident. Sure. Sure. Well, because day eight went by real fast, we're going to do day nine of this episode as well. Mess some shit up. My father got drunk, me and my brother pretty bad. This time it looks pretty bad. I like to go with them. Um, yes. Go for it. Yes, that's fine. Ooh, who can I give? I'm gonna give stripes to Mitchell. Good stuff, team. So I'm gonna be a little short-handed today on my staff, but that's okay. Sweet ginger green by the Pierce Pickering Ragtime Five. Ooh, smooth. See, I'm a little short-handed today, but that's fine. It happens. A few months ago, an unregistered feminist organization appeared in Freeburg to their home in the first protest. For all we know, the organization backed by foreign sponsors the goals to get people in this position to say, Hall, protests may escalate into something more serious, we should in charge. Tons, tear gas, even firearms are necessary to show them what intimidation looks like up close and personal. Psychological test. Your psyche is in good shape. You know, you're concerned your stress level. Cool. Ooh, I have to send four officers and SWAT. Oh shit, okay. So I'm gonna start from the... Megadopolis has rank there, and SWAT. Proceed. Do you have a problem? The chief prosecutor of Freeburg is a woman. It seems to not so feminist, but I'm going have some serious legal problems. Better play safe, fake some evidence, shield you. Oh god. I don't have the money for it, do I? I'm gonna refuse. I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, so I got two people. Okay. Satisfied client enters some lofts with a pistol. Okay. This is some. This game is a lot for the time being. No. I'm not gonna support. I'm not gonna force them. I'm gonna let them do their thing. Peaceful protest. Peaceful protest. Uh, twelve forty at the casino. I'm gonna ignore the call at twelve forty at the casino. <laughs> Go. 
Defender caught. Officers unharmed. Civilians unharmed. Love it. Good, good job, guys. Ooh, young with set fire and fled. Okay. Set moves are with. Proceed. Gotta love the homicide. No, that's, I guess not homicide. That's arson. Ooh, there's a storm of brewing. Ignore the casino's call. Whenever it comes through. Right? Ignore the call. Pull my cruise back in. See if we get another call. Investigation has going back. Hit the wrong button. Investigation has started. Let's see what we got. Okay. We'll wait till we see what the next stuff is here. Good stuff. I just don't want any officers to be killed. There's no point in that. So. See if I uh, can I hire anybody? Do we have anyone in the labor market? We don't. Uh, so right, slots open. So let's do this one. Mr. Boyd saw some new slot machines. Called Mr. Super Megalin. Put one in. One of the bigger kids almost broke it. Yeah, we can send some folks. Let's make And I'm gonna send Chang. So robbery. Fender escaped. Civilian killed. Damn. I got eight grand though. Eight grand. I want to be corrupt as fuck. It's the path I chose. I chose to be corrupt. And you know what? I think it's gonna make this game a little bit more fun. It's like no one, no one ever plays GTA and stops at all the red lights, right? Special gynecologist behaving strangely to persuade her to have an abortion. Doctor said that for only ten grand, she saved me. Ah, yeah. Let's get rid of this fucker. Okay. <laughs> Oh, nice. Good stuff. I got two grand for that. Hell yeah. But anyway, no one stops at the red lights in GTA. So I'm not going to stop at the red lights here. I'm going to be corrupt as fuck. Make this game a little bit more fun. It's more like conduct. Housewife uh, Takara often complains to police about her neighbors making a racket. Call police again after hearing loud bangs. Of course, six or seven people live there. That's cohabitation shit. I'm going to stop that. Megadopolis and Chang are on the way back. Good work on there. Dr. Spots, please grab a scalpel. I'll release your souls from the filthy world. Use pepper spray. Fender caught. Officers unharmed. Good stuff, guys. Mitchell, stronger by the minute. Feminist protests. What? The fuck are you talking about, dude? I don't even know anymore. Like, what, are, what is the expectation here? Yeah, I don't even know. Oh, we're about to bring in a large shipment of alcohol. Heard you guys like to play tough. Need a couple of your guys. Those are my guys. Just sending them out today. Archive. No archives there. Where did I get to mine? I don't know where I get to my archives at, so. Ooh. Shit, I don't have any more. Um, I don't have any more people. They're not on their way back. We're going to retreat. Fender escaped. Close, yeah. I think it's in messages. There we go. Uh, so, ooh, wow. Okay, Mitchell, Robbins, you going? Guess I can always wait it out to see if people come back. Probably what I should be doing, but it's fine. Do I need anything, police station? Backlog. Ah, uh, feminist protest. Oh yeah, he wanted me to actually fuck shit up. Okay. Well. Okay, fine. I'll start fucking shit up. Well, I've got three new frames. Let's do this shit. Stupid. So, oh, if she wanted an usher job, sure she threw a fucking Molotov. That makes sense. Ridiculous. Hey, Megadopolis and Danny Sexbang are back. One of the rooms on the second floor, Stan Jark, see it striking her in the face. Just strike him in the knees.
offender caught, officers unharmed. Good job. Okay. Mitchell is killing it. Mitchell is killing it. I'm glad I didn't fire any of my black officers like I wanted me to. Racism, not good. Not good, huh? God. Arson report. Fender caught. Good stuff for them, Grant. Also making your way up. Got all people up. Moody killing it on this investigation game. We are going to end the day there. Oh my god. Okay. So that investigator just quit. That sucks. He was so good, too. Okay. Well, on that note, we're going to end here. So, I'm not really listening to the mayor as much as I should. I'm in with the mafia. Um, a couple of my people have been fired. I think I fired five people already. Um, my lead investigator, Moody, just quit. So, we're going to clean up some of that mess next time. But, this is with me, Magora. Hope you've enjoyed watching me play. This is the place. I think I'm going to keep going with this. This is pretty fun. Um, we'll see how long this series ends up being. But until next time, I will see you then. Bye-bye!